What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walker right here on our Gym Leader Draven channel. Okay, so in the last episode, we managed to capture the second, uh, the second Snorlax in this game, and I did say that I will be replacing a Pokemon with Snorlax, since we already nicknamed him Tank. Um, and some of you guys probably guessed it right, I don't know, uh, and it was very obvious to which Pokemon I was going to be, uh, be taking out. And that Pokemon was, of course, uh, Dubasaur. Now, Dubasaur will not be forgotten. I will be using them later, um, later in, I don't know, in other generations. Maybe in the next game, which would be Pokemon Crystal. And as you can see, Tank. Very, very, very strong Pokemon. High attack. Very good defense, special is good, but its speed is its downfall, and as you can see, it has, it has high HP. And uh, I did teach him quite a few moves, take down and mega punch, just to complement him on his attacks and all that. And then, uh, it's a good thing that it has amnesia, because if you guys didn't notice, not a lot of special attacks really hurt this guy right now. So, like I said, the Pokemon that I did use in the beginning, like, I don't know, like, uh, what was it, Pig Monkey, or no, Pig... Pig Hammer, uh, Dubasaur, hell, even Squirtle. I mean, they all have a purpose, and uh, you guys will be seeing them again in other walkthroughs, such as Pokemon mm -hmm. Crystal. Hell, I might even, if I can, I'll try even put them in, uh, in another version right here, but mm -hmm. they will be in my PC for from the time being. Right now, I think I got mm -hmm. the team that I really want, and that is this team right here, where it has a bunch of strong Pokemon. Very, very strong Pokemon. Now, another reason why I chose Tank uh, the Snorlax as one of my Pokemon is because it can learn a wide variety of moves not just you know it's normal type moves but you know elemental moves hell I think it can I think it can, it can even learn grass type moves too could be wrong so now let's continue on right here and take on this in this gentleman and try out our very cool very awesome tank so here we go bring it on that right here is like rocker wants to fight Sends out his Voltorb, and yeah, Voltorb is gonna be a little faster than us, but look at that. We got a tank. Tank. Headbutt. Yeah, that ain't gonna work, buddy. That ain't gonna work because this Pokemon right here, his name says it all. He's a tank. He'll destroy you, and uh, what is that going to do? Self destruct. Ooh, didn't really do. Oh, wow, it's, it's taking a lot. It's a critical hit. Wow. So that was a very good showing right there. Now, one of the another downside to having a Snorlax as one of your Pokemon is the fact that it it is a very very difficult Pokemon to actually train up to raise. So you know it's okay. I can I can deal with it. I mean it, it is very very powerful. So I'm willing to train it as far as I can go. And hopefully it will actually help me out in the long run against the next two gym leaders, which is, uh, what was his name? Koga and Sabrina. You know, they do have some pretty good Pokemon right there. I gotta heal up Tank yet again because, holy bejeebus. Holy bejeebus. Okay, so I think most of my super potions are going to Tank because, holy crap. Okay, so that's enough of that. Now we got this little house right here, and if you talk to this gentleman, he's like, I'm the fishing guru's brother. I simply love fishing. Do you like it? To, do you like to fish? Grand. I like your style. Take this, uh, take this and fish, young one. And we do get the super rod, which is a very good rod. I mean, with this super rod right here, you'll be able to find some super rare Pokemon, rare water type Pokemon. Now we do have one more rod. I don't know why. They couldn't just flip-flop it with, you know, giving the good rod to this guy and the super rod to in that future because you obviously, most of you, like maybe 80% of you guys will go to this route right here in order to get to Fuchsia City. So, I don't know. That's kind of my deal right there. Now, let's continue on right here. I thought there was going to be a Pokemon trainer right here. And, like I said, this is probably going to be like a two, three part episode because this is a long way to go. Very, very long way to go. And... As you can see, since we don't have Dubazor anymore, I can't use a, any cut attack to, to get to him, so I have to go to this guy, and I think he is a, I think he's a bird trainer or something, so let's go. Have you found a Moonstone? Yeah, I found like three of them, I think. Three? There's a fourth one out there that I know that, that I could find. Here we have 
junior trainer, the male, wants to take on you, the Pokemon trainer, and he has himself a meter and male. So I'm gonna just Thunderbolt away. Thunder, thunder, thunder. Oh yes. Double kick. <laughs> oh yeah, I had to sneeze right there. And there's that double kick again. Not very good. So let's go again with that body slam. Oh yes. Feeling it good. Feeling it great. And he's coming out with his Nidorino, so let's go ahead and go to Ultra Cycle. I haven't seen you in quite some time. And, you know, off screen, when I was uh, getting Tank out of the PC, I found out one thing. Ultra Psycho can learn Try Attack. So I'm going to try it. And it missed. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I'm just going to stick with Side Beam. Wow. How, how, how does that happen? Wow. I try. Yeah. Wow. I feel stupid right now. I feel really, really uh, stupid. Uh, stupid, like many of my Latin friends say. And, uh... Well, beat you. And, uh... Time to go on with more Pokemon Trainer. Now, if you have the cut technique, you can go through here, and I believe you can find some, uh... I think you can find Dittos, Venonats, a, a bunch of cool Pokemon. I, I believe you can find Farfetch'd right there, too. And, uh, What I'm gonna do right here... Is I'm gonna battle her. Because she's somewhat cool, I think. I don't know. She's not a cool trainer. She's just an average female uh, junior trainer. And she wants to battle you. She's coming out of Goldeen. So I picked the right Pokemon for this one right here. So let's go. Thunderbolts. More Thunderbolts. More wings. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. And he's... <laughs> his experience points is the, the number of the beast. Oh, wow. So... Let's let's stay let's stay with Sparky right now. I'm gonna be using all my Pokemon. And we're just gonna be battling the hell out of all these Pokemon trainers. We have to get to Fuchsia City somehow, and I might as well knock this out of the way because holy crap, holy crap, it's just a it, it's just a messed up thing right here. So there's that. What the hell? I don't know what I just did. So I just switched the tank. How did, how did that happen? I don't know. I, I wasn't even paying attention. I was just talking. <laughs> but Tank wins. Look at that. Tank wins. He ate you for breakfast. And yeah, I just messed up. No, I'm not messed up. I'm just a realist right here. And uh, here we have another Pokemon trainer. He's like, my bird Pokemon wants to scrap. Well, Mr. Bird Pokemon jerk, sir. You ready to lose? You Mr. Mohawk Pokemon, sir? Because you got yourself bird type Pokemon, right? Or flying types, I'm sorry. Shoot. Not all flying types are birds. They might be playing. They just might be a long, an elongated uh, uh, dragon-like Pokemon. You know, Hail Hydra. That kind of stuff. And, wow, that quick attack really took a lot out of us. And just another Thunderbolt. It's critical hit. You don't feel good about that. No, you don't. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, your bird combo lost. It was a losing combination anyway. So, I'm going to switch it out right here and go straight to Hydra. Because it's been a while, man. It's been a while since I've seen your beautiful face. So here we go. Another Pokemon trainer. Bring it. And she's got herself five Pokemon. Now, that's that's kind of one of, one of the biggest things. Like, one of my biggest beefs about this is that, you know... A lot of these trainers right here, they, they have the same Pokemon, they same weak Pokemon, uh, and they, they usually have them in teams of five or six, and it's, it gets annoying after a while. That's, this is why in some walkthroughs that you watch around here, it usually takes a long time just to get around or get out of this place. And, uh, you know, in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, I believe this place, where else? This place... There's another place right here that, that bugs the crap out of me. But it usually takes a long, long time. Um, Saffron, Selfco, you know, that, those places right there. It just bugs me just because of the amount of weak Pokemon that these trainers have. Why can't you just give me a little bit of a challenge? You know, bring out a Pinsir, bring out a Scyther, man. I haven't seen any Pokemon trainers around here with those kinds of, of Pokemon. It really bugs me. It does. I'm just venting to you guys. I'm venting. And another win. And looking at. Oh, yeah. 
Hydra's going to level 27. Oh, yes. And yeah, you got no chance. No chance in hell right here. So, I'm not going to use Dragon Age because I don't want this Pokemon to attack me. Ice Beam. Oh, come on. Okay. This is there. Let's just do it. Dragon Rage. Another victory. And look at that. Oh, yeah. So he's like, oh, lost. Yeah, and I picked up some money right there. Okay, so that's step one, and here is the real challenge. Now, all of these Pokemon trainers, they got they got more of the same Pokemon. So we go right here, Route 13, north of Silence Bridge. Uh, uh. Okay, time to switch them up, and well, I guess time to beat all of these Pokemon trainers. Easily, single-handedly. Here's one. Sure, I'll play with you. First time a beauty's ever said that to me before, huh? Here we go, beauty wants to fight. And she's coming out with a ratatata. Mm -hmm. Ratatata. Ratatata meets try attack It sounds pretty cool, it's like a buzzing sound right there. And yeah, look at that, look at that. Oh yeah, goodbye. Goodbye to you. And uh, Ultra Psycho grows to level 31. And is trying to learn recover. Okay, so. Huh. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna take out Thunder Wave since Pikachu already has that. It needs recover because more than likely I don't wanna be like I might find myself in a hole. Don't wanna be in that hole. And let's go to Thrasher. Haven't seen your beautiful face in a long time too. Vulpix. The six tailed Pokemon going to be beaten with a rock slide. Look at that. Yeah, using all those Pokemon attacks that that uh, little girl in the, in the Celadon the City uh, department gave us, you know. All those attacks. Oh, yeah. And I'm going to switch it up to Tank, because Tank needs more battles. Feed him more. Feed him more. Headbutt attack. And, yeah, that right up you attack. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Say goodbye. Oh yes. Oh you little brute! Eh, uh, somewhat. So, there's only one Pokemon I didn't use, and that was Godzilla. And you're close to evolving, bro. You are close. Do you want a Pokemon with me? Yes, I want a Pokemon with you. Now, is that slang for like, uh, you wanna, mm. <laughs> No, she just wants to play Pokemon. So she's coming out with a Clefairy. There we go. And, uh, there we go. Slash attack. Oh, come on. It was a critical hit, but it should have beaten you right there and then. Oh, God. Okay, so Seismic Toss. Not really a fighting type move, but it still does some damage because I think Clefairy's fat, right? Right. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. And, uh, let's go. Come on, yeah. You will not defeat me because I got a slash. Mm, okay, so that should have happened with the Clefairy. I don't know why it didn't happen. So annoyed. Do you like it's over already? Heck yes. Alrighty, let's move on. So we used all our Pokemon, and yeah, she's admiring the badges. Four badges, baby. Four badges. Bring it on. She's coming out with her, uh, her Poliwag. Wow. Okay, so I'm at a disadvantage, but I don't care because my goal in life right now is to evolve my Godzilla Godzilla to a Charizard and uh, Jesus, okay. Uh, do I have an awakening? Yes, I do. I have six of them. Okay, always always be prepared, guys. I think this is the game right here that I've, I'm really prepared about things. Here we go, Seismic Toss. Finish him off, just like Charizard did in the Pokemon uh, anime. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that. Level 34. Just two more levels, guys. And since you're coming out with another polymag, I'm gonna go with Sparky. Let's go with Sparky. Let's do it, Sparky. Get it, Sparky. Thunderbolt. Sparky for the win. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Look at that. Look at that. I'm getting my experience points real easily right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. 
I don't know about that, but I think there's an item right here, right? There it is. An item. It's a calcium, and I think that... I think that ups your attack. You know what? I'm going to give that to Old Disciple because... Oh, no! That was a special! Oh, my God. Okay, I, I, I may or may not have done... Given out or did a, a service to Ultra Cycle. It's okay. It's fine. Whatever. I'm good. I'm over it. And here we go. Another junior trainer coming out with her PG. <sighs> Come on. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. What should I? Uh, you know what? The ledge is cool. But you know that 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 quick attack doesn't do me any justice right here. Look at that. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, that, I forgot the recoil part. Forgot about that. And, uh, coming out with this meow. Let's go with Hydra. Let's finish it off with Hydra because he has all those special moves, all the, the beams that we want. It's got bubble beam, ice beam, brick. And, uh, coins are scattered everywhere. Yes, meow is a little faster than my Hydra. And, yes, Hydra does need to grow a few more levels. Uh, that ice beam, it may have all the powerful attacks, but it still needs to be like a brute. And uh, coming out with our PG. I got it. I got it. Here we go. Thunderbolt. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Doesn't feel so good, huh? No. And she's coming out with a Pidgeotto, so let's stay with Hydra, because we need to get to level 30 for you. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's some good leveling up. That's some good power ups. And you still didn't grow a level. Oh dang. Okay, so she's like, wow, you're totally one. Yes, I did, and I got more money out of that. So let's move on right here. Um, okay, so there are Pokemon trainers all over this place. And oh huh, yeah, you can go through this area right up the top. It says trainer tips. You select to switch items in the item. In the world. Okay, well I already knew that. Never mind. Let's go up here. And I think that's a bird trainer. Hmm. What should I do? What do you guys think I should do? You know what? Let's go with Tank. Tank needs some leveling up. I need to at least grow him one level in this episode. Just one. Even though it is a tough Pokemon to train. It, it really is. So here we go. Bird Keeper. With five birds. Jeez, man. Five birds. Okay, so... Let's go with that Mega Punch. I want to see what Mega Punch can do. Oh, yeah. I just realized this, but in the Celadon, uh, the Celadon department, you can actually buy Mega Punch and Mega Kick, too. So, if you guys already wasted those two attacks, don't worry. Don't worry. You can find it in the Celadon department. I don't know why. And that takedown attack eats up that Pidgey. Oh, yes. Look at that. And still you're not growing any level, so I'm going to continue on with you, Tank. Tank. With a headbutt. And that whirlwind will not work. And, oh, uh, yeah, that sand attack is finally getting onto me. Okay. Come on. Headbutt attack. And it wins. Oh, yes. Tank is kicking butt right here. Taking, it's kicking butt. Taking names. So let's go with another one. Yeah. Lower my stats all you want. Tank will rule you all. Look at that. Oh, yes. Oh, uh, yeah. And look at that. Finally, level 31. Okay, so my gripe is over. I gotta finish you off right here with Sparky. Because, you know, type advantage, bro. Type adv advantage. Wow, I, like, I can't speak. Brand. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, yes. Loving it. Love it. Oh, uh, yeah. It's like the wind that turns. Okay. Gotta heal my Pikachu because don't want it to faint. And yeah, I think I should be I think I should be healing up all my other Pokemon right here. Well Psycho. Oh, I probably should I probably shouldn't have done that since they already have recover. Hydra. Godzilla, Godzilla, and Tank as well. Look at that. Healing up my Pokemon. Okay. So all my Pokemon are healed. Okay. Oh, we got this guy. 
Alrighty, so what do you want? What are you looking at? I'm looking at something ugly right there. I don't know. What, did your mother beat you with an ugly stick? I think so. Here we go, another biker. Or this is our first biker that we're facing. And here we have tank. Tank. Headbutt attack. Okay. And that smog attack will not work, so let's finish it off with Mega Punch right here. Man, I am loving having a small axe on my team. Very powerful Pokemon. Now, let's finish this guy off with Ultra Psycho right here. Since poison type Pokemon are scared to death of Alakazams. And let's go with that that Psybeam. Oh yeah. Well, that was an easy one. That was too easy. Too sweet, too easy. Let's go again with another. Let's go with Psybeam. Oh uh, yeah. Man, having an Alakazam is pretty awesome. Pretty cool. Alright. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> He's like, dang, strip my gears. Yeah, I don't know. And I think we have like two more Pokemon fans. Yeah, we got two more. Alright, let's finish this right here. Uh can't go up there. So we have to go up no, that wow, I was kind of Wow. Never mind. So let's go down here and okay. So there's two more Pokemon trainers. I could be wrong. Well, let's go back to Godzilla and just win. Just win, baby. Even though you know, for some of you, you guys know where that came from. The Raiders. They suck. It's all about the Niners. <laughs> There we go. Bird Keeper coming out with the Pidgey. Godzilla. Godzilla slash attack. But that quick attack will always hit first. Wow. What is the point? What is... Oh, God. Never mind. I'm not even going to argue with myself right now. Look at that. Ah, oh, yes. Godzilla's dominating. So, just, let's just keep Godzilla right here. I want him to finally evolve into the majestic Pokemon it knows it can be. And that is Charizard. One of my favorite Pokemon, by the way. There we go. Two Ember attacks. I really wish it, it would learn like newer uh, fire type attacks early on, but you know it's Generation One. There we go. Goodbye. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And coming out with the Fero. So this is the challenge right here. Oh yes. I'm gonna use everything within my power just to beat you. Senseless. Evil Pokemon, you and oh god, that yeah, that mirror move attack. It can it can get to you. Okay, the first time that's ever happened. Oh come on, how in the hell did you survive? No. Ah oh, crud. Ah oh, crud. Okay, so just two times. Bad luck right there. So goodbye, hero. And Godzilla wins. Wow. <laughs> Not ready yet. Yeah, well, you got a cool Firo right there. Very good Firo. And yeah, there is one more trainer right there. So we're going to finish him off. Hopefully get Godzilla to level 35. Hopefully level 36. Maybe at the end of the episode? Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Too, too far-fetched. She's like, you need good TM to teach you good Pokemon moves and stuff. And of course, I... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I did not read that correctly. I was just like, ugh, whatever. And he's coming out with three Pokemon, so let's go with those three Pokemon. Oh yeah, it's Godzilla, Godzilla, Slash Cat. Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. Mm goodbye, Pidgey. That was a good critical hit. And still no. Oh, okay, he's coming out with a Doduo. Doduo. Doduo meet the uh, Ember Attack, Fried Chicken style. And now oh, you got the face again. Let's go again with another fried chicken style attack of Ember. And that Ember attack does the job. Look at that. And still nothing. Hopefully right here. Because it's another evolved Pokemon. I know I get more experience points from four evolved Pokemon. And here we go. Double edge. Hopefully for the win. No. And that sand attack will do something to me, which. Uh, yeah, it did it to me right now. Oh wow, why are you preventing me? from getting to level 35, you ignorant Pidgeotto 2, you! Alrighty, critical hit. Alrighty, in level 35, finally! 
Okay, so at least we accomplished that. Not good enough. Yeah, you're definitely not good enough. So, let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon. I know, I know, maybe... Yeah, maybe next time. So, let's go ahead and switch it to Thrasher, because I haven't seen his, his beautiful face in like 12 minutes or so. I don't know. And let's face the final trainer right here before we you know, move on to the next episode. So, hello, how you doing? TMs are on sale in Sonon, but only a few people have HMs. Well, that's me. I mean, I could give you some. I mean, it never go to waste or something. I don't know. Here we go, another Pokemon trainer coming out with whatever Pokemon he has. Pidgeotto, yes. And luckily for me, I got some Rock Slide attacks. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. It should have beaten him right there. Why? Why must you do this to me? Okay. Horn attack. Yeah. Didn't like that, huh? You did not like that. And he's coming out with a Fira. So I'm going to just stay put right here with my Thrasher. Thrasher! Rock Slide. And here we go. Rock Slide. For the win. Ah, oh, yes. You gotta love that. Oh, come on! You should have fainted! You should have fainted! Let's go with Thrash. I completely forgot that I had Thrash attack. Oh, God. That Fury attack is the death of the Oh, God. Uh, come on! Stay put. That's four times. Thrash. Thrasher, Thrash, Thrasher, Thrash. Level 31, right there. Got some good Pokemon right now. Alrighty. I was like, ah, oh, bummer. Yeah, it is a bummer. Anywho, we're gonna stop right here, guys. In the next episode, we'll be completing this whole thing. It's probably gonna be another 30 minutes or so, but yes, we will be completing it. In the meantime, keep on thinking what's gonna happen right here, because you know for a fact that Godzilla's gonna evolve in the next episode. I gotta get Hydra to level 30, and everybody else too powered up. So stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we will be back for another fun-filled episode of Pokemon Yellow! See you guys.